Yeah, we were just comparing. I knew you girls were going to be talking about that baby rhino. There's three toddler girls here. Talk about girl power, and they're not 200 and some pounds. These are about a thousand pounds each. I'm joined this morning by Christy Morecambe. She's with the Wildlife World Zoo. And Christy, these rhinos came from South Africa. Um, they came here in October and they're ready to show the world, show the Phoenix Valley what they look like. Absolutely. So right now we're in our new Safari Park expansion. It's eight acres, making the total area of Safari Park almost 25 acres. And today's the grand opening, so now people can come out and finally come face to face with these girls. Oh, and tell me, they were born in the sanctuary, so they're familiar, uh, they've been around people, so they're they're excited to be, and you know, ready to be greeted by Phoenicians that are, are coming out to see them today. Absolutely, so they were born under human care, so they're very familiar with being around people. When they got here, they actually acclimated very fast. Being here in Arizona, our climate really lends itself to African species. And they came out and when they came into the corral for the first time, they took a big mud bath. <laughs> They're uh, doing great with positive reinforcement training. The Aww. keeper staff here actually works on that. They're working a lot of husbandry behavior. So if we ever have to do any husbandry or medical behaviors on them, they're comfortable and familiar with it and they can participate in their own health care. And I mean, I know that you as a zoo are trying to create a program for the endangered species that are out there. We were touching a little bit on that. Tell us a little bit about um, in the wild, they are at the possibility of being extinct. Unfortunately, yes. So rhinos are one of the most endangered animals in the world. And if something doesn't change and uh, change drastically, these guys could go extinct in our lifetime. Uh, their biggest problem out there is going to be poachers. So in South Africa alone, okay. three or more rhinos get poached a day. Oh my goodness. Okay. So part of them coming here is a possibility of them going back out and helping, you know, cultivate and, and bring more rhinos into the world so that we don't have that possibility. That's right, because if rhinos do go extinct in the wild, we want to make sure we have a healthy, diverse genetic population under human care so Perfect. we can sustain the species. And when these girls get older, they are going to meet our older male Aww. rhino, Butch, and we'll hopefully have a <laughs> great, successful breeding program. You tell me that Butch is, Butch is here, but he's not necessarily going to be introduced to them just yet. Yeah, they'll have to get a little bit bigger. Butch is a little bit older. He's actually in front of Adventureland. So okay. our visitors can come out. They can see Butch. They can come out and see our beautiful brand new girls, our white okay. rhinos. And we're just really excited for what's to come okay. for the future. And yeah, with them being so endangered and uh, under such a threat before they came here, uh -huh. we actually had to have them protected by armed guards 24 hours me. a day. Well, thank goodness they're here and they're in good hands here at the zoo. Now, your doors open at nine o'clock this morning, so come on out, join the fun. Um, the girls are expecting to see Lena and Jamie and all of our, you know, AZ family viewers out there. So you open at nine. We do. We open at nine every single day. Come out. The weather is going to be fantastic today, and with over a hundred developed acres, even if we're busy, it doesn't feel, feel busy. It, yeah. yeah. I was just asking Christy earlier about, um, you know, just. What can people expect with the new um, safari park being open today? And she said, you know what, Carla, we're so big that you won't even feel that it's, you know, going to be a little bit more crowded than usual because the park is so big. So, again, if you have, you know, you're at home today, you've got the kids at home, come on out. Uh, the three rhino toddlers are waiting to come see you. Aww, That's all we have for now, ladies. I'll toss it back to you in the <laughs> studio. Yeah, there they are. Have they been named yet, by the way? They have. So we have Mashaka, Zuri. And uh, Lena. Oh my gosh. Mashaka. Lena. Genius. Armani. Armani. Yeah. Armani. Uh, okay. Yes. Go ahead, learning. guys. The next three we want <laughs> named after um, us. Jamie, Lena, Carla. She wanted to name it. <laughs> Christy knows this too. All right, She's ladies. Have before. a good one.